I want my MTV! Two class, one, two. I want my MTV. I want my MTV. Our goals overall is to improve, improve our technique, improve our conditioning right now. Um, at the end of the season, we're looking to qualify more guys for state. We're looking to qualify, uh, have a better results at section this year. Uh, last year we had four. We're, we're looking to have more section champs. Uh, we're looking to have possibly state champs, state placers this year. So uh, overall goal, we're, we're looking to push the program to the next level. Totally different work ethic overall with our athletes. We have athletes that trained in Europe. Uh, I, we were able to, uh, I was able to send guys to Europe. There's a life outside that I didn't know. Tied up, falling down to an empty soul. I'm Joseph Cano. I am mainly a, an artist that draws people. Uh, I've been making art since fourth grade, pretty much, but I kind of actually started taking it seriously around like seventh or eighth grade. It only recently started being acceptable, you know, to, to my standards at least. I like seeing all these different figures, like all these different people, and being able to tell stories through the, the art I make and stuff like that. So I can say, like, oh, I really like this. I want to make art as good as that and stuff like that. My name's Randy, and I'm a dancer, and I also do acting, like theater-wise. I basically started like around like eighth grade, like going like the summer going into eighth grade is when I started, and I basically taught myself mostly everything. Whenever I'm dancing, I feel like I can express myself more and I feel like I can show what I'm feeling instead of having to say it more. What helped me a lot was looking up stuff on YouTube, like how to do this, how to do that, and it honestly helps. And it also just helps like having like drive, telling yourself you want to do something and going and actually doing it instead of sitting around and not doing anything. Yearbook's on sale now. Come get your yearbooks. At the bookstore, only fifty-five dollars. Grab yours now. Cut, cut. Okay, Marty, Marty. I, I just feel like you know you're not selling me the idea. All right, it, Marty. You know, let's, let's do it one more time. And you know, say, all right, here we go. Take three. All right, here we go. Action. Your book's on sale now. Go get yours at the bookstore. Only fifty-five dollars. Get them before they run out. Cut, Marty. Okay, you you. You need more passion, you know, you need more, more, you know, emphasize it a little bit more. Got it? Yeah. Cool. All right. All right, here hey, we go. Hey, uh, can you speak up a little bit? We just got this fresh shipment of new yearbooks. Only $55 at the bookstore. All right, all right. Come, okay, come on. You know what? I'm done. I'm done.
outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. I'm Dion Reese, this is my man, Cole Tofil, and we're talking to you guys about the Millennium Baseball Pancake Breakfast on December 15th from 8 a.m. to 11 a.m. It's all you can eat pancakes and bacon and syrup, so come there to have a good time. You can bring your whole family. Tickets are just $7. Find a baseball player like my man, Dion Reese. My man, Cole. And you guys can go.